Today I have a Hey Little Magpie haul to share with you. Um, got a few bits of the new Amy Tangerine collection. Um, this is on a whim and yes I've got some more Amy Tangerine stuff and lots of paper as well. So yeah this is her new collection on a whim so I'll give you a quick flick through. I like that one. So it's sort of like summery pinks and florals pineapples and ice cream swans pizza so sort of like holiday kind of themed so i got that and i got the die cut pieces and they've got pink foil you can see that and that's things you get so you get like a flamingo um Hearts, pineapples, ice lollies, little ice cream truck, cactuses or cacti, um, donuts, those sort of things. I also got the new stickers from Dear Lizzie. I'm not sure what, I think it's Oh Lovely Day, it's the new range. And these are the puffy stickers. I thought I'd only get one thing from this collection because I wasn't too keen on it. Um, but I will be going back for more. So you've got things like cameras, girl, hot air balloons, Gemma Rose, you'll like them. Um, there's lots in this collection. Bonjour, love. I got it for the fox. Um, I got some of the papers because of the foxes, um, but I'll definitely get some more of this collection. And then got these Jen Hadfield um, gold foiled rub ons. I've only got some Amy Tangerine rub ons, so I thought I'd try these. And I look, like the look of them. So I've got them. I also got um, some of the bits from the Crepe Paper Cool Kid collection. Um, I don't have a kid, but my little dog Tyson, who's male, and all my scrapbooking supplies are sort of girly. Um, so I've got these stamps, mainly for the dog and the cute boy. But I can use the plane as well when I scrapbook and journal about him. And I also got the Cool Kid um, 6x12 sticker sheet. So I thought they were ideal for him when I scrapbook about him. Because otherwise they're going to end up looking really girly. And he's a boy. So yeah. I've got these. And they're ideal to use. I like that. Boy. A noise with dirt on it. And then it's just got some sentiment stickers so best ever wow too cool epic amazed adventure time funny so i got that and then i got some papers i got more than what i realized i got and i really need to stop with the 12 by 12 papers so i have to stick them here you don't want to see that so I've got this jen hadfield um warm and cozy it's got the stags on it and then it's got the black and red sh chevron um recently just used this in a general layout for tyson so i've got some more sorry if you can hear him barking um i also got another warm and cozy it's got this chevron and then this sort of woolen blanket look yeah the collection is called warm and cozy and this is called comfort Juliet. i'm not sure what that is i got aloha sunshine um from coco vanilla uh this is from the endless summer collection you're not going to be able to see this it's really very pale yellow with really pale white circles but I got it for this one, for this side. And this is gorgeous. I love this. This is perfect for documenting holidays, beach days. So I may have to get some more of that. I'm terrible with 12 by 12 papers. Oh well. Um, this is from Crate Paper, the new collection Oasis. And this one is Tropic. This one's really nice as well again perfect for summer and then it's just got this 
beigey brown with white polka dots. Then there's this one. It's by, again, Crepe Paper Oasis, and this is called Sunset, so it's just this really gorgeous sunset watercolour effect. And then on the back, it's these sort of waves. I prefer the sunset side, that's why I got it. It would help if all these papers were the right way. I've got Crepe Paper Cool Kid, and this is the Boys Club one. It's got the black and white crosses, and then it's also got the cut apart side. Um, but I'll probably more likely just use the black and white crosses side. Another one from Cool Kid, this is Wild One. <coughs> Excuse me, and it's got the dinosaurs on it, which I thought was quite cute. And then the back is this just ready orange. I'm not sure what they are, chevron, I think. I don't know. And then I got this. Um, it's from Chanel's new collection, Little by Little, and it's the delightful journey one. Just lots of lovely feathers pinks and blues and yellows and then it's got this on the background this would be perfect for scrapbooking as well so I might have to get some more of that <coughs> and then another one by Schmel little by little and this is the bear hug one I really like this and then on the back is this one and some Amy Tangerine papers on a whim um, I didn't want to get the 12 by 12 paper pad um, in case I didn't like the full collection. I'd rather have 6 by 6 because it's easier to use on cards. Um, yeah, so this is on a whim, ray of light, and I really like the blue leaves and patterns. And then on the back is this, this is very bright. And then it's got some emojis this one is again Amy Tangerine on a whim Tropical Paradise and I really like this it makes me want to go on holiday and get out of cold in England and then the, on the back is this sort of blue green ombre effect with the white triangles I might have to get another one of them then I got the pineapple one it's called Fine Apple and then it's just got this Imperfect orange and white stripes one with some hearts. This one's called Confetti by Wim as well. Quite nice. And then it's just this pink ombre effect with the blue and white flowers at the bottom. This one's called Patchwork. I really like this one. And it's got this on the back. I love this one from on, on a whim. It's called Let's Flamingi. Let's Flamingi. And on the back is this one. Sorry, my dog just went in my bag. Um, yeah, I like that one as well. This one is yes, yeah, Dear Lizzie, Lovely Day, and Tag Your Bit. So it's all the cut parts. I uh, thought it was really cute, I like the rabbit. And then on the back are these blue and grey horses. And then this is why I got this paper because of the foxes. If you know me, I'm obsessed with foxes. And it's called Foxy Friend. There's a nice pale sort of duck egg blue colour. And then on the back is these dark, dark blue or navy with the light blue leaves. So I've got I've also got this one from Simple Stories from their new collection Faith. Um, I just really like the cluster of hearts. And then on the back it's got these words like blessed, praise, charity, beautiful, love. Um, but I won't use that side. They've got um, the one from Domestic Bliss. It says bless the mess. I really like the pattern. Again, that's from Simple Stories new collection. And then on the back it's these pale sort of blue green wood panels. And then I got the Simple Stories 
graduation range and this is the 3x4 and 4x6 cut parts. Um, I graduate back in July but I haven't documented it yet and I thought I would get that. I then got this from Crates Paper Heart Day and this one's called Snuggles. I really like the hearts and imperfect hearts. And then on the back it's got loads of these Valentine's lovey dovey things. Ugh. Um, so yeah, it's got hey hot stuff, love notes, love forever, but I'll just use the hearts because it's nice and simple. It can be used for anything. Um, this one again from Heart Day collection, Adore You. I really like the simple um, floral design. It's then got this sort of bright red with the red hearts on as well. I've got this one from Maggie Holmes, her new collection Chasing Dreams and this is called Keepsake. I love this. I can't zoom out anymore um, but I absolutely love this. It's gorgeous. So it's got like yellows and blues pinks and stuff in. And then on the back it's just sort of this paler design with numbers and letters on. This one is from Dear Lizzie Lovely Day and this one's Cess Lovey and it's just the cut parts and again I got it mainly because of the fox but I thought it was really cute and it's got a little hot air balloon tag which probably go to Gemma and so yeah some cute things and then on the back is this sort of this ombre pinky orange uh, with hearts and then it's got numbers at the bottom that's pretty much everything I got. Um, I am missing some stickers that I got from the Simple Stories graduation range, which I'm not really happy about, um, but I'm sure it will get sorted. So thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video.